Eric Garner Snipes was born on May 29, 1990 and died on December 30, 2017. He was an American activist who advocated for police reform, particularly in the use of force during arrests. Garner became involved in activism following the death of her father, Eric Garner, in 2014 after a New York City police officer placed him in an illegal chokehold during an arrest. Garner had two children. Shortly after the birth of her son Eric, named after her father, in August 2017, she suffered a heart attack. Doctors subsequently found that her heart was enlarged. On December 23, 2017, she suffered a second heart attack, after which she fell into a coma. She was left with major brain damage leading to her death on December 30, 2017. She died at Woodhull Hospital in Brooklyn surrounded by her family. On the news of her death, New York Mayor Bill de Blasio said the city would miss her unshakable sense of justice and passion for humanity, despite the fact that Garner had been a frequent critic of de Blasio during her lifetime. The New York Civil Liberties Union issued a statement saying that Garner showed incredible courage and remarkable resolve and bravely transformed her unspeakable personal pain into political power as she became a leader in the fight for police reform. The National Association for the Advancement of Colored People, and AACP, also issued a statement acknowledging her leadership and strength. Fellow activist DeRay McKesson said, Erica took the truth with her everywhere she went, even if that truth made people uncomfortable. Tweets were subsequently posted from Garner's official Twitter account demanding that de Blasio explain how she died with no justice and requesting that out of respect to Erica please do not request comment if the journalist is not black.